CMU's baseball team looking for a five-game sweep over Adam State, but Adam State has the lead. Base is loaded, two outs, and that shot is going to bring in a run. One runs in. Here comes another run to the plate, and he's in there. Five to two Grizzlies. Bottom of the fourth now, CMU with a runner on second base. And here comes Spencer Bromwell to the plate. And he's going to get one in. Chase Hamilton, as that one goes to the fence, is going to come around. He will score. And just like that, CMU trails 5-3. to three. CMU wasn't done, folks. Same inning. This is Matthew Turner. And he is going to find the alley. Bramwell. He's going to come on down. He will score. CMU now trails 5-4. to four. But in the very next inning, CMU would give it all right back. Chase Hyatt. He's going to get an RBI. 6-4 to four Grizzlies. They will score three runs in the top of the fifth. They will build an 8-4 to four lead. And listen to this, folks. I left this game and walked over to the women's lacrosse team to see what they were doing. When I left the stadium, I said, it wouldn't surprise me if the Mavericks come back and, you know, wipe away that deficit and from the lacrosse game I can hear all these cheers and I'm thinking to myself what the heck is going on at the stadium well let's look at this full screen to see what was going on at the stadium they scored 16 runs after I left <laughs> they scored a run in the fifth one in the sixth um, six runs in the seventh I mean it just kept going on and on Eight runs in the eighth. They pound the Grizzlies pitching. 20 hits in this one. They sweep the five-game series. Uh, Matt Turner, three hits, five RBIs on the day. CMU improves to 13-3 and three on the day. Folks, if you haven't seen the CMU baseball team, they're a tremendous ball club. You got to go check them out. That's all the time I have for sports. I'm Derwin Morrell. Here's your ski report.